Endicott Interconnect started out as a company with only two clients, IBM and Sun, and now its, its main focus back then was the assembly of servers. But now EI has clients all over the country and a brand new assembly area right here in Greater Binghamton. Endicott Interconnect, or EI, employs roughly 2,000 people, more than 100 of which work here with the Integrated Circuit Assembly Services Group. They produce what are called substrates, essentially the brain of technology, such as the processor in your home computer. All of the silicon, the chips that we have, and all of the components that we end up purchasing go onto these parts, and then that's what we assemble and, and ship out of here. But EI does much more than print circuit boards and assemble. The company has now diversified, including research and design. For customers, that's a pretty good value add that when things come into here, they, they don't have to go to another company for, for any other uh, piece of that assembly or test or integration. In fact, Vice President of Development Raj Rai says EI is developed into a company valued by the government. A lot of the work um, that we do in here is, is typically all aerospace and defense uh, related based on, you know, Endicott Interconnect being a U.S. based company and uh, aerospace and defense related activities pretty much have to happen, you know, within the bounds of the U.S. And in those fields, Rye says the new emphasis is on size and weight. For example, with rising fuel prices, sending a satellite into space becomes more and more expensive. I mean, our customers have told us that every um, ounce of weight that they can take out of a satellite is worth four ounces of gold. With that incentive in mind, Rai says EI has reduced satellite loads by several thousand pounds. But EI technology isn't limited to aerospace. Technology made here in Greater Binghamton can also be found in items ranging from catheters to communication equipment. And in one of EI's recently completed projects, communication technology made right here in Greater Binghamton is now out there in space somewhere on a satellite.